Yes, actually, uh, I'm with Danielle. We just finished uh, uh, his vasectomy. How do you feel now? Uh, really good. No pain at all. No pain at all. Okay, you don't feel busy or no, nope. no, nope. no. Nope. Nope. Okay. So, uh, what was your um, what were your expectations? You thought it would be worse, better? <laughs> no, I think it was pretty what I, what I was expecting. Uh, just a little bit uncomfortable sometimes, but uh, in, uh, in overall. Uh, it's really uh, easy uh, and uh, so smooth and easy. <laughs> very good. Okay, very good. Um, you asked me, uh, Alison, about COVID. Actually, I was telling you that we, we changed uh, many things. Uh, first of all, I used to do my vasectomy with no mask, no, no glasses like that. And uh, obviously, the patient didn't have any, uh, any mask. Um, we used to see all our patients with a pre-vasectomy consult about a month before their vasectomy. We do that all by telephone now. So we cut the number of patients coming to the clinic to uh, ask. So that's, that's the major change we, we did. Uh, besides that, now we're in uh, two different offices where we um, are pretty uh, on our own. So we are able to do uh, the surgery as we used to do. But uh, like uh, Danielle, his wife is outside because uh, we have some uh, public health um, uh, security uh, rules that we are not allowed to have the, uh, the wives anymore in the room. So uh, unfortunately she was, uh, she was not with us this morning, but we used to have all the wives coming uh, whenever they want. We have about, I would say about 25% uh, of the patient were coming with their uh, partner at that time. 